Hi everybody! Welcome to Amy's Little Bit of Everything. I have another Timu haul that the post office guy just brought by. Excuse me, I'm going to turn this just a little bit. Okay. And I got some really cool things and I put some stuff together. I always open my box and bags so that um, I'm kind of ready to go whenever you guys get here to see everything. So, um, and we've got another baseball game tonight. So I thought I better get this done because there's really cool stuff. Okay, I'm just going to have everything laid out. So I'm gonna start over here. I wanted to get a cake cutter. I've never had one of these before and I don't know if it works, but you know, when you bake a cake and you wanna cut it in half, like if you wanna half it or put something in the middle or icing or pipe or a, like a filling, but I've never had one of these, so I wanted to get one of these. So there's that. Then my father-in-law, we're having him a birthday party. It's a surprise birthday party. And I thought these were a littler than what they are, but they're happy birthday. And you stick them in the cupcakes. They're gonna be a little bit big, but I'm gonna do it anyways because it's glitter and, and it'll be fun and it'll be shiny. I'm trying to get one out so I can show you. It's like that. So, and there's all kind of colors. There's red, purple, silver, gold, all kinds of stuff. And I think the silver and the gold one are the only ones that, oh no, they all have glitter on them. And they come with these little sticks. They're gonna look huge on my cupcakes, but they'll be cute. So I really don't care. It'll be something fun, but I just thought, oh yeah, I like that one that's purple and red and black. And they got teal, but I got a couple packages of them. So, you know, we'll put them on there and and just have fun. But I got, oh no, I got four. So, you know, we'll try them. Now this next thing, I'm gonna wait for that because I may need to get the camera down and show you. Yeah, I think I will, hold on. All right, we're gonna go over here. All right, I got these really cute scissors. They are nice. Um, I was kind of concerned. They got a little pointed tip, so definitely not for kids. But um, I like to use these for my sewing, and it's just a nice little clip. But these are, like, they weigh. They're, they're not real heavy, but they've got some weight to them. So I would definitely recommend these, but they are gorgeous. And I got the multicolor. And they had all different kinds of um, handles. Okay. Then I got, I don't know how well they'll work, but I drive an older car and um, it's red, but these are for cars. Like if you get a scratch on them, well, I've got a couple of places on mine, not anything bad, but there's a red one for my car and my husband's got a truck. So I don't know, my car's older. I thought I'd give it a try if it works. It's just got a few spots on it, but, um, and they're not very big, but I thought maybe if I touch them up with a little bit of red, it might work. I just thought I'd give it a try. So I got those. Then I got these ink pens. They were called, oh, the coffee ink pens. Just taking all the box for that one box. But um, it says this one, coffee love, coffee I love. They just have them in, I don't know how well you can see that. Then there's the brown one. And then this is kind of like a rose, rose color. And this one's kind of like a light mocha. But um, I already wrote with it. And they write pretty good. They're pretty smooth. And they've got this little clip here. You can clip them on your um, notebook if you want. So there's those. I got these for um, either 4th of July party. or But they have a little battery. I mean, a little battery. A little light on them. And it's for the kids, it lights up, and it's like a slingshot, and they go up in the air and it lights up. And I thought that'd be pretty. We do a lot of like fire, like um, fire, or uh, weenie roast, the fire pit and stuff, at late at night. So I thought that'd be something fun, because you know kids like things that light up. So I thought that was pretty cool. This next thing, pretty cool to me, but it's not gonna be pretty cool to a baby. It's a booger picker for a baby. My, one of my nieces is trying to get pregnant, and she's the one that has a little Henry that I have every now and then. And um, this gently goes in their nose. And you know how sometimes the babies, it's hard to get. I always waited for Henry when he fell asleep and I'd dig in there. But, um, but I got two of those. 
so I thought I'd give them a try. And it's, it's really soft on the end, so you're not going to hurt them or anything. And then I got some of these. Um, some of you guys will know what they are. Some won't. But there's those elastic, like, um, my husband, like, if he gets a cut, it's a Band-Aid on it. Band-Aid don't stay, but you can put that around. Oh, I know a lot of people, um, like, after you get blood drawn, they'll put the cotton ball and then wrap this around you. It's like a, a tape. But a scent for sensitive tape. But I got those because around here we've always got somebody hurt or somebody needs something. So I got some of those. And that wasn't a bad deal, guys. I can't remember how much I paid for it. But um, they're 12. And I mean, if you went to like CVS or Walgreens, you're going to pay way more than that. And then um, they had some of these band aids. I don't know if you can see it, but it's the white and square. And then some of these that was guaranteed to, I think it was um, like an adhesive strip to hold, they claim that it holds real tight. Um, and like I said, my husband's always getting hurt, so I always grab up stuff like that when I can. Then I got a power strip for all the SUVs or whatever you call those things, but it looks like that. And in my office and nail room, I have tons of these, so you can even turn them on, like if you want one on, want one off, or you want to keep them all off. You know, I thought it was pretty cool, they got all those buttons, so, and it does plug in like that, so, I thought that was kind of cool. I got some nail stickers, um, I think, yeah, I got two each, but it's, um, mushrooms and leaves. And some flowers and this one is flowers and little girls and actually guys I think I think there's two in here let me just check so you know oh yeah oh the back is different okay glad I opened it up I love the cactus let me see what the other one looks like it's pretty cool I'm glad I opened it up now. I wasn't going to because I thought there was just one in there. And then this one. Oh, cute. It's got like fire, smiley faces, eyeballs, baby. Oh, no. Okay, let me make sure I got them up the right way. There's that. So those are pretty cool. But um, I like doing them on my toenails and fingernails. So that's kind of nice. I didn't know there was two in each, so that'll be good. Then I got, oh, some nail, this is just some glue to use for nails. Um, like I like to put the diamonds and stuff on there. Then I got, I haven't used, I, of course I just got this. Oh wait, that's face Um, That's a top coat. All right, here's one. These are like mood mood gels or whatever you want to call it. Let me see what for temperature. Let me see. Yeah, it's got a little temperature thing on it. It says thermal nail gel. So it changes colors with your temperature. I thought it was mood, but it's temperature. <laughs> so the hotter you are, the it'll change colors. But I got, oh gosh, I don't know how many I got here. There must have been a good deal on them, but I got orange, I got green. And blue that turns to purple. I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, sixteen. So I must have got a really good deal on this. But two is top coat, two is base coat, and the rest are like change from purple to blue and all that. So that'll be cool. When I wear these, I'll try to put a video up so you guys can see it if they really change. Okay, and I got these because I thought they might be fun. I used to do these when I was a kid. I know a lot of you guys probably have, but um, I got two packs of these. I like doing them, and if I have kids that come over and visit, grandkids or nieces, nephews, um, we could put those together. I thought that was fun. Now I got to show you this. This would be an awesome Christmas present um, for a boy or a girl because to me it's like chemistry. But it's fair, well, I guess fairy potions, but I mean, it could be for anyone. I mean, I'm going to put this set probably together, but oh, the glare there. 
But this would be an awesome, awesome, I opened it up, this is just the box, an awesome gift for Christmas birthday. And then it comes in that box, but then it comes in another box. And first of all, it comes with a really nice book. It says Fairy Potion Making. It comes like this, and then when you open the book, it opens like a butterfly, but it tells you like in, Inspiration Potion. Um, health potion wish to be healthier um, and you know it's it's for fun so and then dream dust I just I love this kind of stuff lucky potion Wow inspiration smart Ooh, dump that on me happy I'm, I'm happy all the time and travel potion uh, want to carry some magic with you. Turn one of the bottles into a necklace. Oh! Oh, they have necklaces. Oh, I didn't know that. Alright, so here's the, the instruction booklet. And I have no idea what some of this stuff is. I do not know what this would be for. Oh, maybe to put some of your stuff in. But you get these little two containers. I'll honestly have to just check it out. And then you get the little funnels. You get two of them. Then you get some of this stuff. You probably cut it up. And I like the little container. Probably cut it up. You know, you put it in the bottle. And then you can um, put a sticker on your bottoms to tell you what they are. You get two of those. Then you get the corks. And then, I'll show you the bottles here in a minute. But you get, oh. You get dye. So you'd have to, this is blue dye. You'd have to, you know, it'd have to be an older kid or really help them out. Oh, and more blue. It says two dyes blue and one green. And then you get all a bunch of little bottles like this. And the corks are going to fit in that. This is so cute, you guys. And then you get a bunch of glitter. And then you get all these boxes here. And then you get this little thing. Isn't that cute? Wouldn't that be an awesome gift? I mean, and then like that, you got little little um, stars. Um, glitter. Oh, and then some is just rocks. I wonder if those are glow in the dark. Those might be glow in the dark. But really cute. I mean, when I was little, oh, and then you get some beads. And then the rest is just glitter. But, um, oh my gosh, if I was little, I would love this. And these are, yeah, they're plastic. They wouldn't be glass. But how, how cute. But what a cute little set. And the, I mean, you could use these if you want to, or without those, I mean, with a smaller kid, you wouldn't really need them. Oh, hold on. We got more, we got more stuff. Okay, and then we got some greenery. We got a magic wand. Another magic wand. Bing, bing. And then we got purple string. Oh, purple string. They show that you're tying it around. Let me show you. I don't know if you can see the purple string on that bottle, but there's a perfect string and like you tie a charm on it. That's cute. And then you could tie probably like a little butterfly. Oh wow, I'm gonna order some more of these. And then there's like maybe a unicorn thing. And then stuff to stir your potion with. You get three spoons. And well, you get two unicorn things. And then you get three of these little butterflies. And then you get I don't know how well I can show these. Flat two flowers and one lucky charm. So wow, and I can't remember how much it is. I can look it up, guys. Um, and I finally got my sponsor code for um, Timu, and I'm so excited. So, because um, you know, I always get my stuff like at a discount, or I wait till I get a really good. Um, like a oh what am I thinking like like one of those like 
$40 off or $50 off. They're always sending me that kind of stuff, and I'm always using it. But um, this time I got my sponsor code, so. Okay, so now I want to show you these. I got two boxes of these. You put, um, I think it's AA batteries. Yep, um, double A batteries. I should have, oh shoot, I should have put some in there. But then you spin it back on there and it has a, or no, I guess, I guess it just automatically comes on. But you can put them in your pool. You, um, I was gonna use mine because they have the batteries. I mean, you literally have to would take them out, take the batteries out. And I didn't know that, I thought they were solar. I thought that little thing was a solar thing and I must've read it wrong. And it does come with a remote because you can change the collars. Oh, well, I guess you could turn it off after you're done swimming. Okay, all right, I will use it then. And then you can turn it off, you can change the collars. Um, you, can, you can change it to brighter, um, fade, smooth, strobe, and flash. So that's pretty cool. You get three of them and a remote. And maybe I didn't think they were I think I thought they were solar. I like everything solar. And then I got two of them. Yeah, I'm a solar type of, of a gal. Put me, give me on solar, and I'm good. Okay, and then, oh my gosh, this thing is huge. I got a new pool thing, because ours was starting to rip at the seams. So, you guys, this is really nice. And like I said, I always wait for the dills. And I can't remember how much I paid for it, but I, if you have any questions or um, want to know how much, I'll definitely can look them up. But here's this. And I know we paid way more than what I paid for. And then we got the little sweeper. Um, I don't really know how it goes together. I'll have to have Jeff do it. But um, And then the little vacuum thing and the little bag that goes on it. And then you put your hose on it. And you can suck all that stuff up and clean it out. And like I said, it was hardly anything. And I was shocked when I saw it. And I was like, oh yeah, I'm getting that. Jump in my cart. And then, I know I showed you this little trolley before. These are so nice, guys. And I put them together. I normally can't put stuff together. They've got rolling wheels. They've got the stopper so you can lock it in or not lock it in. And it rolls. You've got this um, one, two, three baskets. You got these little baskets that hook on. You can take them on or off. Um, and then you can roll it around. I got, I already showed one of these already. I'm leaving one in my office. And um, this one I'm gonna take outside because I always have garden gloves, scissors, cri tripper or clippers, um, just little odds and ends. And sometimes I keep carrying it in and out or taking it to the garage or something like that. So this time I'm just gonna put it on this and then push it in the back, push, you know, like on the back of the front porch and then I have everything ready to go. So I got another one of that. Now this last thing, I think this is my last. Hold on a minute. Sorry guys, I've been running like this all day. I went to the grocery store and did a Kroger pickup and Dollar Tree. I'm gonna have to start doing Dollar Tree things, but once I get home with my Dollar Tree, I just put everything away. I could not imagine doing a lot, you know, a video on it, but I need to. Okay, guys, this is the big thing. Now, granted, I knew from Timu, I thought, well, it's probably, I was thinking it would be bigger to where I've seen them before, to where your kid could stand up and play with it. But I'm satisfied. I think I, I want to say like maybe $8 for this, maybe not even that. But anyways, okay, it looks like this. You put water in it, it plays music. You have to put batteries in it, it was AA batteries. But I went ahead and put it together so that you guys can see it. Now I'm gonna try to do this to where I don't really have to move. Uh, there, okay, here. Alrighty, so here's this. So I'm gonna turn it on. Now the thing is, is to, I'm gonna add water to it. I don't know if water does anything or if it just sits in there for a kid to play. But all this was, um, you got the drain here. It's got little holes in it. <coughs> there's that one and it doesn't, so it would be like a little scooper. Then here's the fishing poles. And you uh, 
would reach down and scoop you up a turtle or a fish. There's fish and turtles. And then hook that back on there. And like you saw, um, when I turn it on, this little thing rolls and the music plays. And you can play different type of music. Each button is different music. Now, hold on, I'm gonna get some water and me and you are gonna see what this does. Okay, now I have no idea if water does anything at all. <coughs> you can also put the little fishies in there too. So I don't know if it drops them out, so I'm gonna put some in there. I'm gonna put one up here. And this also has a little button to where you can see what I did. I'm like a little kid. And you can push that. Come on, push that little fish out of there. So now I'm gonna add water. I have no idea if water does not do anything, but we're gonna to see together. Okay, so I'm gonna turn it on. And this little thing has like a little, I don't know, let's try it. Watch, I'll probably have whoa, water all over the place. It is. It's blowing bubbles. Hold on. Hold on. No way. No way. They are, guys. Do you see them? Hold on. Look. Here they come. That water has got bubbles. <coughs> Let's separate it. And see, it's supposed to go over that. I don't know if I have that little piece in there. Maybe I don't have enough water. Oh, there. There. I need more water. Oh, look at Guys, this is so cute. My nephew is going to love this. This is another perfect little gift. And they're supposed to go over that thing. Maybe they don't have enough water. Huh. Oh, here they go. Well, that does work, guys. Is that awesome or what? And it kind of gets hung up there a little bit, but once you get them over that thing, and like I said, I may not have that piece in there right. I'm gonna have Jeff look at it when he comes in, but it does, it blows little bubbles out. And maybe I don't even need that piece, let me see. Yeah, it's just kind of without this little piece, it's just kind of, it's just um, blowing bubbles. But, I don't know if it, Yeah, they're gonna get stuck right there if I take this little piece out. So I might have um, too much water in it. I may not have enough. And I have it clipped down. But I even thought it'd be fun, you know, putting water in that, filling that up with water. Thought that would be fun. But how cute, look, they're going good now. How cute, I love it. And you know, to play outside, I mean, me and Henry, we're going to sit here and see like this. It pours water out. And this one, you know, you can scoop it and pour it on there. And let me see if that does anything. I guess he does it. He just kind of just have to push that thing down hard. Come on. It doesn't do well with the little fish, but there you go. And you take your little cut one. <laughs> Love it, love it, love it. All right, guys. Um, I think I've shown everybody everything. Oh, I don't know if I lost you guys. I hope my video didn't get messed up by that. I had someone call in and then I happened to hit the wrong button, but that was pretty cool. Okay, that's my Timu haul. And I love the little swimming pool thing and taking outside and letting Henry play with it and whatever he wants to do with it. That'll be awesome, so. All right, I think that's it. I will um, get back with you with another haul and have a blessed day and get out there and have some fun and we're getting ready to go to another ball game. Probably the way the summer's gonna be, but having fun. God bless everyone and take care.